Um, hi, Jim. Oh, hello, Jackie. Can I come in? We don't have long. Um, are you drunk? Not drunk, more sedated. Sedated? Yes, yes heavily. Uh, um... Thank you, Jackie. We'll... Come on. Come on, come, come, come on, Miss Good Boy. That's, that's it. Come on, we'll... we'll... Uh, Oh. Uh, uh. Boys, Martin, are you are you okay? What happened? Everything all right? Yeah. Hello, boys. M man, Jim sedated. Sedated. Yes, you see, I went to take my special pills for my. We don't need to know. Funny bottom. The thing is, they look. Just like Wilson's sleepy pills. You took Wilson's sleeping pills? Yes, Martin. I opened Wilson's bottle, put a couple of pills in my hand, and then swallowed them. Jim? Oh, dear, I've done it again. <laughs> Sit down. Where are you going? Open the bloody window. It's bloody boiling in here. Oh, Hello, all. Hi, Jim. Have you been there long? Probably about 20 minutes. Hello. Oh, Jim. Oh, Jackie. What are you doing here? Why well, have you got a great big bubbly bath outside? It's a hot tub. Hot tub. Hot toilet. Thank you. And do Jewish people not take baths indoors? Uh, not on Friday nights. Ah, of course. Shalom. Shalom. He's here. Shalom! Shalom! What do you do, Brian? An artist. I'm an artist. Oh, what kind of thing do you do? Anger. <laughs> Pain. Ow. Fear. <laughs> Aggression. Watercolours, or...? It's a little bit more complex than that. I've been looking forward to this for so many years. Well, <laughs> hope you like it. Oh, here, let me just move this out of the way for you. Oh, be careful! Oh, oh, you shitting tit! Oh, oh, Jesus! Oh, so much blood! It's so much blood! It's paint, Jim! It's so much blood! Don't move, Jim. I can't see. No, no, don't touch anything. I mustn't touch anything. Oh. Like the wall. Oh. Oh. Or the oh. TV. TV. Oh. If that's all, Penny, it'll never come off. Oil oh, paint. Um. Please tell me it's not oil paint. Please tell me it's not oil paint. OK, it's not oil paint. Is it oil paint? Yes, it's oil paint. <sighs> Uh, that's it, Jim. Keep going. Keep going. Okay. Not far to the not shower. Far. Try not to get any more on the wall. All the snow, Jackie. Get all the banisters. The banisters. This is the same gallbladder, and here we can see the small object has become dislodged and is now down here. This is what I like to call the Mick Jagger effect, because it is essentially a rolling stone. Which is a joke, you may laugh. <laughs> You're not laughing, Mr. Boyce. Oh, that's because it wasn't funny. Yes, it was. No, not really. I'll be the judge of that. You can't be the judge. Look, you only don't find it funny because you know very little about imaging techniques. When you've had as much experience as I have, you will find it funny. I doubt it. Hmm? You can't make me laugh by poking me. Well, just... heed me.
Who is it? Father Christmas. Oh, it's you. Who do you think it was? Daisy wants to have a housewarming party tonight, so she sent me down here to ask you if you want to come. Is Marsha coming? Uh, I don't know. She's just going out to ask her. What's the deal with you and Marsha? You know about the deal. What? I'm busy, Tim, painting a triptych. Oh, yeah, what's it called? Bad sandwich. Really? Yes. Mm. It's a piece about violence in its immediacy, the instancy of the event, a synchronic rendering of three explosive, aggressive expressions. There'll be girls at the party. Really? Yes. Mm. Relatives, friends, and shalom! Jim? Oh, God. Please, sir, this is a holy place. Yes, my liege. Shalom. Bleeding hell. I... Go on. Sorry, Rabbi. <laughs> Jim, did you follow us here? Shalom. What are you doing? Well, Wilson and I have come to pay our respects to the corpse. The car carcass. Ah, uh, his name was Saul, Jim. Saul, Jim. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry! For the second stage of the scan is the powerful pulse of radio waves which knock the protons out of alignment. Uh, uh, is that a mobile phone? Come on! <clears throat> was, uh, was what a mobile phone? That noise. Didn't hear a noise. Well, I did. Could you describe it? Yes, it was a kind of chirp. Chirrup? Yes, like, um, chirrup. Could it have been a chaffinch? Stuck in the ventilation shaft? No, it wasn't a chaffinch, Mr. Boyce. A chaffinch goes. Chiff chaff? A chiff chaff. I wonder what noise the onomatopoeically named chiff chaff might make. Sort of chirrup noise? Chiff chaff. Chiff chaff. You're beginning to sound a bit like a tit. Come here. <laughs> come on, come here. Arms up. Yes, I'm unarmed, I swear to God. Assume the position. Stop that. Oh, I can't help it. You've got really masterful hands. No, I haven't. Aha, here we are. Now, I can only assume this is of the utmost importance and can therefore be shared with the entire class. Oh, I'm not sure that... Um... Uh, hello, um, Booker. Hello, boys. Oh, hello, boys, yes. Hello, boys. I win it. Uh... Want. Oh, yes, want you with a you. Very clever. Yes, I want you to c come. Come. I want you to come on my... T -t -t Quite forward, isn't it? She's a primary school teacher as well. Hello, Velva. So, come. <laughs> Hi. Um. Hello. Hello, Velva. Yeah. Hi, Velva. Nice invitation. Hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hi. Hi, Velva. Velva? Hi, how are you? How? How are you? How are you? How are you? Brian, painter. Damien, Damien. Damien Hurst, hi, Brian. Um, Velva, I'm talking to Damien. Is it water with the sheep in the, in the box? No, I, I, I paint. Lots of work with paint. Better now, Jim? Yes, much better, Mummy. It's Jackie. Yes, and to think that my house was broken into by brutes. Brutes? It makes me feel all dirty, like I've been used as a kind of lavatory. Uh, lavatory? I'm fine, thank you. Checked everything, all the windows, doors, locks. No one's getting into this house tonight. How about out of this house tonight? Yeah, can we go soon? Oh, you don't want to go too soon. What? Oh, is that a little cello? Um, it's my violin, Jim. May I? Oh, you play the violin. Oh, yes, Martin. I used to play in an orchestra. And until Wilson left a, a little something in the tube. Go on, then. Let's see. Let's see. Yes. <laughs> it's a bit out of tune.
Oh, um, any news on the other thing? What other thing? Whether or not moustaches are back in fashion yet. No? No news? You keep me posted? Yeah. I'll, yes, and I'll let you know when, when, when they find a blonde who's got more than two brain cells to rub together. Not, not you. Or, or you, obviously, you've got lots. Well done. But, but you, Dr McCartney, are about as intelligent as a gracilis myocutaneous flap on a uh, perineal hernia repair. Banter. Vulva, hi. Brian, you came. Wouldn't have missed it for the world. Are you still painting? Not exclusively. I'm um, moving into multimedia pastures, you know, installations, a platter of organic processes mixed with a pinch of irony and a side helping of self-deprecation. Sure. <laughs> Sounds delicious. You should see what's for pudding. <laughs> <laughs> You came. Um, no, I just spilled my drink. Oh, hello, Jackie. You look nice. Oh, Christ. Um, oh, hi, Jim. Why are you...? <clears throat> you may be wondering why I am dressed like so. Um... That's because I'm collecting money on behalf oh, of... Oh, did you make that outfit yourself? No, Martin. I hired it. It's quite accurate. Oh, yes, no. I added that bit myself, you know, for fun. Ding, ding. In tray. Funny. Ah, Dr. McCartney, take a seat. I'd rather stand if it's all the same. Uh, I'd, I'd rather you sat. Yeah. Surely it's my choice if I sit or stand. Uh, not on this occasion, no. Okay. Please be seated. No, thank you. Uh, what do you want to see me about? Uh, this is my office. Uh, please be seated for our discussion. I'd like us to be at the same eye level. It creates easy, flowing conversation. Mm. You could stand if you want. You sit. You stand. You sit. You stand. No, will not be... Thank... Right, now, uh, I, I wanted to have a discussion with you about your review with the board next week. And this is... This, 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 this is the kind of behaviour that they will not tolerate now. Will, will you be sit? No. Look, look, this kind of insubordination is precisely the reason you were, you were overlooked for promotion last Wednesday. Right. And, and, and as a result, get out. Okay. I'll discuss this with you later when you're less... Handsome. Le less... Charming. Less sitting. Get out. Thank you. You can sit now if you... I, I will not! OK. Little Ewoks. An entire... Empire brought to its knees by small, furry creatures. That's my point exactly. Leave them alone. Brian, did you notice that everything that transpired in those three films, and I mean everything, can be attributed to the actions of one very minor character? Who? The gunner on the Star Destroyer at the beginning of the first film. How come? Well, mm -hmm, because if the gunner had shot the pod that C-3PO and R2 were in, they wouldn't have got to Tatooine, they wouldn't have met Luke, Luke wouldn't have met Ben, they wouldn't have met Han and Chewie, they wouldn't have rescued Princess Leia. None of it would have happened. Chaos theory. Eh? The predictability of random events. You know, the notion that reality as we know it, past, present, future, is in fact a mathematically predictable preordained system. So somewhere out there in the vastness of the unknown is it equation for predicting the future an equation so complex as to utterly defy any possibility of comprehension by even the most brilliant human mind but an equation nonetheless oh my god what I've got some fucking Jaffa cakes in my coat pocket Let's all play kabaddi. You get them, Dave. Where am I the tea? I opened the window. Brian, it's your turn to do something. Right. But nothing is happening with the house. No one else is coming. No one's going to buy it, OK? Unless, of course, Jim does. Thank you. Imagine this was the last time we ever ate crumble in this house. Crumble, crumble. OK. In this room. Very good. At this table. Seriously. What the bloody hell? Shitting 
shitting, shitting! Shit on it! Oh, Martin! My car! My shitting car! How did that happen? Uh, I think I know. Hello, all! Just checking the roof. 